hey guys welcome back to meg's vlog so today i'm going to show you how i made this asun and plantain delicacy all right so here i have my plantains ripe plantains diced okay into tiny cubes and i also have my red yellow green bell peppers and in here i have my scotch bonnet pepper which i blended with shallots and i also have my fresh tomato which i diced okay and i also have my onions and one raw egg and my goat's meat which is asun you can use any meat you have okay it's not a problem all right just dice it in cubes my paprika my whole oregano and that is it basically so i'm just going to add the paprika into the already diced um ripe plantains i'm also going to add my whole oregano in there as well my whole oregano herbs that herbs is really really nice and tasteful and flavorful okay so you can use that if you have it and i'm also going to add some salt to this and i'm going to mix everything together that is all i'm using for the plantains and i'm just going to mix everything together okay <music> So after that is done the next thing i'm going to do is to boil my goat's meat okay so yeah um i know i use some other um ingredients in this okay but i'm going to list all the ingredients in the description box don't worry about it all you just have to do is concentrate on this video okay so you don't miss a step all right so as you can see i added some onion i also went ahead to add my fresh pepper okay and i'm also adding some rosemary you know i said earlier that i use some other ingredients but don't worry i will list everything in the description box all i have i want you to do right now is to just give me your attention okay so i've added that and i'm also going to add two seasoning cubes to this so all i'm doing is you know spicing up my asun or my goat's meat so it can cook and taste delicious so guys the next ingredient i'm adding in here is my curry powder like i said do not worry i'm going to list all the ingredients that i didn't show previously in the description box so just give me your attention okay and the next one is my pepper soup spice you guys know this spice is heavenly like this is my go-to spice and the next one i'm also adding is my salt okay so after doing this i'm just going to add a little bit of water to cook the meat you guys know goat meat can be tough so we don't want to you know just marinate it like that and fry it without cooking it first okay so that's why i'm actually cooking it because if this was beef or the normal cow meat i think i wouldn't have gone through this process i would have just you know marinated it fried it and that is it but this is goat meat so yeah <laughs> So at this point my goat meat is ready and i just went ahead to taste it and i'm just going to cover the up and allow the water dry in the meat and set it aside and then i'm going to proceed to the next phase which is adding my vegetable oil into my frying pan so this oil i already used it before to fry plantains so yeah i'm using it again because it's still very clear okay yeah so i just went ahead to add the ripe plantain i'm adding them in batches because you know it's kind of much for this frying pan so i don't want it to just crowd everywhere so i can have some space to stir that up so yeah i'm just gonna stir this up and allow that to fry and fry and fry and that is it <music> So 
the next thing i'm frying is my asun or my goat's meat okay so i'm just going to fry this till it's golden brown and i'm also going to set it aside as well so endeavor to fry your meat whichever meat it is you're using make sure that you fry it and set aside and then after doing this i'm going to proceed to the next phase <music> So guys after that is done i went ahead to reduce my oil because we don't want to use so much oil to make the sauce okay so i'm frying my onion i added my onion and as that is frying i also went ahead to add the fresh um diced the diced fresh tomatoes okay so i'm just going to give that a quick stir and then i'll proceed to add the next ingredient <music> So guys the next ingredient i'm adding in here is my fresh pepper which i blended with some fried shallots okay yeah so i'm just going to add this this is really the shallot really gave this a very nice flavor okay so yeah i'm just going to stir that and allow that to fry a bit <music> So guys i'm going in with my cumin powder so that is my cumin powder that i added into that uh, mixture and also my curry powder as well and some salt so i'm also going to add my egg remember i use just one raw egg you can use two or three it depends on the quantity of the um sauce or the meal that you're making okay so you can use more or you can use less it's all good all right so i'm just going to stir that up and fry it and after which this is how it looks and then i'll proceed to add the three mixtures of my diced bell peppers which is the red the green and the yellow bell peppers guys can you see the burst of colors oh my goodness this is so welcoming this is so inviting and trust me at this point the aroma in my kitchen was something else it was heavenly okay so i'm just going to you know stir that and allow that to fry and i'm going to proceed at the fried plantain so this process is really easy it's not very difficult it's a meal that is so easy to make and then i added my meats as well and i'm just going to fry that and allow that to fry and that is it guys it's really not that hard my recipes are so easy to make and trust me when i say they are really really delicious okay so after that is done i'm just going to you know allow that fry a bit and the next secret ingredient and the last ingredient i'm adding in here is my yaji okay so this is my yaji or suya spice okay whichever one you call it trust me this took the taste of this meal to the next level like it was really really yummy and after adding the yaji or the suya spice i'm just going to stir that up and that will be it guys <music> So guys our asun and plantain recipe is ready this recipe really bangs can you see the burst of colors and it's really delicious so we leave you trying out this recipe do you love this recipe tell me in the comment section don't forget to subscribe share my videos and like till next time i love you thanks for watching bye